Now your microclimate forecast presented by Bill Howe. Here's meteorologist Carlene Chavis. No need to get away for a tropical vacation. We've got one <laughs> happening right here, whether you want it or not. That's right. Bring on the heat and humidity mm -hmm. and the people who are not happy on social media. <laughs> Letting you know about it. Yeah, I don't blame them. I, yeah. I'm not too happy about it either. Or our producer that's in there as well. Kim and I decide we're going to be friends by it's next week. It's the human stuff. It's the human stuff. <laughs> exactly. It's yeah. humidity. It's sticking yeah, around, literally. And so we are talking about the humidity sticking around for tomorrow. Also on Thursday, we're keeping those warm temperatures, but there is some relief in sight. Taking a look at how we shaped up for today, we were mainly in the 90s for the inland valleys, but we did hit a high of 88 degrees for Vista. 80s along the coast, again, 85 degrees for Carlsbad. Also 80 degrees in Oceanside, 84 for downtown. 77 in Del Mar, not too bad in Del Mar for today, and 109 in Borrego Springs. Now it's a pretty warm night, and we're still going to keep that into the overnight lows. We still have an 81 degree reading, and that is for El Cajon. 80 degrees was the uh, temperature last hour, Escondido, now down to 79 degrees. 70s right along the coast, 72 for Del Mar, also holding on to the 90s for the desert. 71 degrees right now for Palomar Mountain, and also in the 70s for Julian. Taking a look at that humidity, we are still in the thick of it. So the dew point temperatures are still running fairly high, and that is adding into that moisture. So we'll continue to see that as we go into the overnight hours. Overnight lows added with the humidity. It's going to feel warmer than usual. We'll be into the low to mid 70s for overnight lows for the coast and inland valleys, all because of that area of high pressure that won't budge. So we're still looking at monsoonal moisture for tomorrow and still holding on to a chance for thunderstorms for today within the clouds. 922 lightning strikes for San Diego County cloud to ground 101, a more active day for today for the cloud to ground lightning. But we'll continue to have that possibility for tomorrow as well as Thursday cooler as we hit our weekend forecast. That's because the trough of low pressure will start to move in, so that will knock down our temperatures back into the seasonal range by this weekend and then going below seasonal, especially on Tuesday of next week. For the coast, keep in mind we do have a low risk of rip currents, also a southwest swell wave heights about two to three feet. 80s. We're taking those into Friday. By the weekend, a nice little relief. We'll be back into the seasonal range for the coast, going from the 90s into the 80s for the inland valleys. 80s will return by Sunday. I know some people are happy about that. Mm -hmm. Also talking about that dip in degrees. I'm saying cooler, not cool for the desert as they go back into the upper 90s by next pretty week. Pretty much everyone's happy about yeah. that. It's heading in the right direction. Yeah. Dryer, that's all we want. Yeah. Please, thanks. <laughs> like that.